Hello, this is Hacker the Bean, and today we are going to be tumbling. If you like this video, please leave a like on the video, comment down below, and subscribe to the channel. Now let's get right into it. As a child, I'd been told the moon controls the time. And it's with no additional explanation, it was like, oh, okay, you want me to believe in magic? You're talking about magic right now. Okay, fine. Oh, it's worth 70, but it isn't going to influence the sun with about 27 times the time, I mean, 27 million times the mass of the moon. It all is always the gorilla in the room when it comes to the solar system equations. But it's a distant gorilla, about 390 times farther away than the moon. So I only said related, but I simply wasn't ready for the sun is a distant gorilla. Thank you, NASA. The sun is a distant gorilla. <laughs> Hot things to say thirty naughty times. Dang, son. Bless you. Yabba dabba do your own name. Hell, Hitler. I don't think I could say that. Radical. Gnarly to the max. Tubular. How dare you? Oh well. I'm sorry. I'm so, so sorry. Psych. Trust me. These work 100%. I had the sex once. Once. And you're already making me say stuff. That's why we got a list. Some list of people I don't like. Okay. Well, did you smoke my Orphic Mystery weed? Me? Whoa. First, they phased out the 22 episode season, then they phased out the 13 episode season, and now they're phasing out the 10 episode season. Like, can you guys go watch fucking movies or something and stop trying to tighten television? We need to go back to more episodes because shows can't be action or drama all the time. There needs to be breathing room for both the audience and the characters. There needs to be good filler episodes where the characters get to just have fun and develop outside of the main story. Side quests and downtime are important to storytelling. We need to see the characters be regular people with regular problems in between the big stuff. I just remember that in middle school, there was a kid named Yugana in my at lunch, and every time he bought a pizza, I was like, You gonna eat that? And I guess I was kind of resting him, so he told the principal, the principal made me buy him a pizza for resident. And next day, day, I was like, You gonna pay me back? And that's sorry how I almost got south with a plastic fork. You live up to your URL. I like you. The URL is irritate. Oh my goodness. Hang on. I am not doing the freaking open a new tab thingy if I don't have to. I want to go to this exact point and run around it saying, I'm in Sweden, I'm in Finland, I'm in Norway, until I get tired. I aspire to great things in life. According to Google Maps, that point is in the middle of a small lake. So we'll do it in January when it's frozen. Actually, that's why they a, a helpfully dropped a big cement block with a bridge around it in the middle of the lake for the express purpose of doing what OP aspires to do. Oh my goodness. There's so much beauty in the world. Oh no. The internet... 
It's broken. Oh dear. You know it's bad when there's ads all of a sudden. <sighs> Finally. That was bad. Okay. My law teacher built a 10 foot fence because he hated his neighbor, but the city made him take it down because there was a 5 foot limit on fences. So he poured 5 feet of concrete on the ground and built a 5 foot fence on top of that. And so he tried suing him because it was 10 feet, but they lost because the actual f fence was only 5. What the frick? Why did this get notes? Because your law teacher defeated the law. I mean, the law usually does defeat the law. Oh gosh. Yeah, but you have to open this in a new tab. I did not want to do this today. You have absolutely no clue. <sighs> wonder which one is more unstable, the internet or me when I'm making these videos? <laughs> <sighs> okay. Just gonna do this. Somebody is doing something that they shouldn't be doing, and now the internet is suffering because of it. Okay, neat. But you'd be like, these are my comfort characters, and it's a group of murderers. Someone tagged this as BTS? No, but they're not totally wrong. In the BTS universe or lore, I'm pretty sure a couple of them have killed people. I know Tan Young has for sure. I don't know about the others. It's been a while since I cared about music videos or lore. Okay. This is a side tumbler I didn't want to go to. The basically a bunch of music videos starting from I Need You have contained a running story with the members playing different characters. I don't remember much about it because A, I'm not as big of a fan of BTS anymore, and B, the recent MVs haven't referenced it, but this article has decent rundowns of each of the characters. 
a trigger warning for mentions of car crashes, family death, hospitalization, abuse, murder, and suicide. What the heck? But yeah, a lot of K-pop groups have kind of writing stories throughout their music videos. A tease lawyer's base is probably easy to understand. You don't even want to know about the Lunaverse. Lunaverse? <laughs> Lunar theology. I am not reading all that. Sorry. You can try to make me, but I'm not going to. I have seen man made horrors beyond your comprehension. You try to read this and your brain explodes. This is what it feels like to chew five go. Hey, remember that old freaking ad that nobody it, 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 it cares about anymore? Yeah, let's reference it now. I love how the URL is like going to these episodes, but to the family, she it just freaking dies all of a sudden. The URL walks into oh, oh, the electric fence. Red is really having a bad day, huh? Oh, look at the kitties. Soviet Russian grandma cats complain about their grandchildren and swapping recipes. They have ear holes, let me die. Babouche cats. Yes, babouche cats. Black and orange might be the classic Halloween colors, but let's not forget purple and pale turqu turquoise. They are 100% as ghastly and ghoulish. Thing is, the colors of Halloween are all of the colors. You'll see Halloween promotions like, We made our milk street eggs green! Spooky! I remember green from the Lion King movie when, uh, uh, during the bad guy's speech. Or our entire product lines where it's all red because that's like gothic vampire stuff or devilish. Blue motifs for haunted mansions. White ghosts and bones and ivory. Pink guts and blob monsters. Halloween just celebrates every possible color palette and aesthetic. I mean, yeah. It's like the anti straight. If you Catholic MFers were really so interested in God's design, you would develop a theological appreciation of fetal biology. We really just say anything on here, huh? Bridge evolutionary biologist and geneticist JVS how the equipped that if a god or divine being had created all living organisms on Earth, that creator must have had must have an inordinate fondness for beetles. Beetles account for a greater number of species than any other single group of living animal. So only one out of every four animal species on Earth is a beetle. Prove this would drown in the depths of your ignorance. My goodness. Saw trap where it's one or more of the beetles and they gotta get out of the murder room before the sun passes above the magnifying glass window. Oh, and fries them all like ants or something. I don't know. Sun, 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 here it comes. My blood looks more beautiful than yours. It's a more luscious red. Edward Collins, not gonna. Anna, fuck you, babe. You picked the right. I target, you're just a decade late. This would have ruined me at 16.
I don't want to go to college, but I also don't want to not go to college. What I really want is to stop existing, but you can't do that without dying, and I don't want to die either. This is the most accurate post I've ever seen. This is every college student. <laughs> oh my goodness. One of my favorite things to see is random people trying to interact with unfamiliar outdoor cats. Just standing there with a the hand out, making kissy noises, maybe meowing at the cat while it ignores them. Mankind at its best and least dignified. Alright. I think this might be yeah. I mean, this might have to be the last one, and it's gonna get really political. Let's have fun. Let's go. Being a leftist sucks, by the way. We are right about terrible stuff and get to see it slowly happening. I've been talking about climate refugees and a fear mongering about them causing a massive rise in fascism for years. And it's like, cool, I guess I was right. This sucks. Literally, we literally said to Udi is bigots, the freaking bathroom bill is going to affect more cis people than trans people. And guess what? It affected it more cis people than trans people. Maybe you should consider becoming a centrist or an independent like me who listens to both sides of the argument and makes their own opinions and arguments. Yeah, I'm not an idiot, so I won't. Oh, so I won't do that. Being a right about things sucks. Have you considered being wrong about things instead? <laughs> Literally, we've said all these things before, and we're right. Anyway, if you like this video, please leave a like on the video, comment down below, and subscribe to the channel. I have no idea what I'm going to be doing tomorrow, so until then, goodbye!